Hello guys, I'm Holly Series and I'm back with a try on haul. I went online shopping and I found a bunch of leggings slash yoga pants and I just got them in the mail so I haven't tried them on yet. We're gonna test to see how well they fit today and give a little review. I have the first pair of leggings here. And I'm going to scooch over to the side so I can show you the try on part simultaneously. I really loved the color of these leggings. I would call it a bare beige. When I was shopping online, I specifically looked for leggings that had a scrunch butt because I think they're super flattering. If you'd like to see more try on hauls, make sure to subscribe. I'm trying to reach 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year and I'd be so happy if you were a part of them. But I was also a bit scared that they wouldn't be squat proof. What that basically means is that if you squat, the bag gets kind of see-through because of how stretched it gets. This being the lightest lay-in means that it could happen to this the most. And I would definitely not wear anything dark under this, but I think this one is squat proof and not see-through or sheer in any way. Talking about stretching and stretching the leggings, these leggings don't really have that much stretch, but they do fit super nicely. I would almost say it's a perfect fit. And I'm very happy about that because if a legging doesn't have a lot of stretch like this one, it's harder to find one that fits well. I can definitely see myself wearing these in winter with a big sweater on top. I just love the color so much. I think these were definitely worth it and also super affordable. They were only around 10 or 11 euros. Because I only had one complaint, I'm gonna give them a 9 out of 10. You can't deny that these leggings really make your bubble butt shine through. In my opinion, fall and leggings are a match made in fashion heaven. They bring that perfect blend of comfort and warmth to chilly days. And I absolutely love how versatile they are. I can't resist pairing them with sweaters, scarves, and cozy jackets in those rich autumn, autumnal hues. Whether I'm out and about or hitting the trails for a fall hike, leggings are my go-to choice for a comfortable and stylish season. They just look amazing. On to the next one. The next legging is this snake skin legging. The fabric of this one is a bit thicker, but it is a very bright fabric. Therefore, I would also not choose to wear anything dark under it. Just like all of the leggings, this one has a scrunch butt that is not as noticeable. Like you can barely see it, it's right here. And because of that, if I'm being super honest, I think I'd feel more comfortable wearing these in public. I love the colors of this yoga pant and the pattern is just so pretty. I can definitely see this becoming one of my faves. Although there is a downside to this one and it is how high-waisted it is. Especially if you go to the gym, a high waist can be very useful because if you're moving around, maybe your shirt moves around with you. But this is so high waisted that at the top it gets loose and it kind of looks weird around my torso. Nonetheless, I will also add this to my active wear collection. I think these leggings are super stylish. They were also cheap. I think they were, again, I think all of the leggings were around 11 euros. They're definitely worth it. But because I had one complaint, I'm gonna give them a nine out of 10 again. A lot of leggings patterns are really weird to me. They remind me of bus seats, but that's why I love these leggings so much more because the snake skin pattern is a vibe that I'm so into. The next seamed scrunch butt legging is this one. I really want to point out the color. It's a hazelnut and I love this color so much. Just like the first pair of leggings, this is another one that I see myself wearing in the gym as well as outside with a big sweater and big comfy boots for upcoming fall and winter. And these are actually the same type of leggings as the first pair, so these again fit amazingly. They have a super flattering scrunch butt that really make your glutes pop. And because they're darker in color, they're also more squat proof. And on this note, I also want to give you the advice to always wear seamless panties 
under your leggings because leggings are so skin tight. Just like the first leggings, they look just amazing. I love them, but for some reason they have even less stretch. But I have a feeling that the more I will be wearing these, the more that they will stretch out. And that's why I'm worrying about the second pair of leggings a bit more, especially the waistband is always the part that wears out the most because you, this is the part that you have to stretch the most to get in to the leggings. That's why I prefer a rather tighter fit at first rather than the second pair of leggings that was already a bit loose on the waistband. Maybe you think these are also a 9 out of 10 because they're not as stretchy, but because I love the color so very much, I'm going to give them a 10 out of 10. I'd love to pair these leggings with a cozy sweater, a jacket, comfortable boots, a scarf and that would be a perfect outfit for when I'm out and about during the fall and winter seasons. But not only would I wear them there, of course I would also like to wear them for a workout or when I go running. So tell me, what's your favorite way to work out? Mine is running through the woods at night in the hopes of meeting aliens or witches, but so far I've only ever seen a ritual site. On to the last pair of leggings. Here we have a sky blue one with a cheetah print. When you first take them out, they look really short, but they have a lot of stretch. This is another pair with a thicker fabric. There's this really cool design along your hips that goes all the way down. There's the scrunch butt in the back. This one is a bit more noticeable, but not as much as the first and third pair of leggings. I think this is a very fashionable piece for the gym. I really have no complaints. It's a very fashionable design. It's a comfortable fit. It's not too high-waisted or too low. And on top of that, they're squat proof. Out of all of the leggings, these are the ones that I think I'm gonna be feeling the most comfortable in. But because the hazelnut colored one just had a, the best color, and that one got a 10 out of 10, I'm gonna give this a 9.5 out of 10. All in all, I think all of the leggings were super worth it. They're very flattering and trendy. I wouldn't call this a 100% cheetah print because cheetah print is characterized by irregular small spots. Although leopard prints are rosette shaped and this is kind of something in between. So I'm not quite sure about that. I hope you enjoyed this try and haul just as much as me and I hope to see you in my next video. Make sure to subscribe if you like try and hauls. Don't forget to leave a like and comment. Alrighty, I hope to see you in my next video. Bye bye!